This is a video reply to Grappling Ignorance's recent upload, Quotes and Rhetoric. So I'll play a quick excerpt from that and then respond. Take it away, sir. That being said, there are a few quotes that get thrown around from some fairly bright people that I pretty clearly disagree with, and I want to take this opportunity to address a few. Those who sacrifice liberty for security deserve neither, attributed to Benjamin Franklin. Well, that's just bullshit. We don't live in a society that grants absolute freedom because it would be unsafe. We sacrifice the freedom to drive at any speed to make the highway a more safe and secure location. We sacrifice the freedom to murder people who get on our nerves to live in a safer and more secure society. And any increase of security requires the forfeit of some freedom, and it's smarter to argue for what you think a healthy balance of the two is than to assume that you don't deserve freedom or security uh, just because you're willing to make the essential sacrifice of one for the other. Okay, so the title of your video was Quotes and Rhetoric, and by the way, it had a, a fairly decent lead-in, but in this section you went uh, partially, if not fully, retarded. Okay, what your video should be about is misquotes and rhetoric or paraphrasing, masquerading as actual quotes and rhetoric. Benjamin Franklin said no such thing. I realize you said that, that that phrase is attributed to Benjamin Franklin, but the ignorance of the person presenting you the argument is that person's problem. You, as an educated person, should correct them, which I do take a delight in doing in real life when people throw this uh, mischaracterization of what Benjamin Franklin said uh, in my direction. The actual quote is, they who can give up essential liberty to obtain a little temporary safety deserve neither liberty nor safety. So it's not this freewheeling absolute freedom that you're talking about that Benjamin Franklin is discussing. You should explain to them what's lined up behind the actual quote, not the the bastardization of something that Benjamin Franklin said that uses some of the same words that's, uh, per that's perpetrating the fraud in, in the mind and statements of the person you're arguing with as being what Benjamin Franklin actually argued. You should explain to them what he's talking about, which is about essential liberties not just this, as I mentioned, this absolute freewheeling freedom that you're discussing or you take the quote uh, that these people give you uh, to mean. To procure for oneself and perhaps one's uh, close kin a little temporary safety. So I just found it funny that you were talking about quotes in rhetoric while not actually discussing a quote that's used in rhetoric. It's a misquote that's used in rhetoric. Have a great day. I had a story class week. Fear grappling ignorance. I like most of the video, but you went slightly over part of it. <laughs> 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 you think I should do it like that?